Hello everyone and welcome back to High Mathematics. Today we have interesting limit. What is the limit as x approaches to infinity of the function nature log square of x over lower x cube? So let's use direct substitution at first. I recommend you to use direct substitution every time and we will see what will happen. So in our denominator, if x approaches to infinity, we have infinity, of course. And in our denominator, we will have x cube, if x approaches to infinity, we have infinity as well. So we have infinity over infinity. So we don't know what the values that represent. So we need to simplify this a little bit. We need to use a little bit trick right here. We need a little bit simplifying method right here. So in this case, I recommend to learn or to remember about the L'Hopital's rule. What is this rule? I write this rule really quick because if we have, for example, function x approaches to a and we have the function f of x and over g of x equal to 0 over 0. So if we have a limit, if x approaches to a of this function equal to 0 over 0, and we will have limit, the second case, if we have limit x approaches to a of the same function f of x over g of x equal to infinity over infinity, so 0 over 0 or infinity over infinity, so we can use a L'Hopital's rule, so then this limit x approaches to a will be equal to f prime of x over g prime of x. So we can find derivative from our denominator and from our denominator. So this is a L'Hopital's rule. I write this rule right here. L'Hopital's rule. So let's use this rule. Let's find derivative from our denominator and from our denominator. So as I write this limit right here, so as a result we will have that this limit x approaches to infinity of the function nature log square x, of course derivative, and the lower x cube, and we find our derivative. So what are we going to do in this case? Of course we can find this derivative because this derivative is table cases. Let's start with this one. We will have 3x square. This is a power rule right here, 3 jumps right here. And right now uh, in our exponent, in our power, we have minus 1. So 3x square. And in our denominator, we will have, first of all, we find derivative with this power. So we will have 2 natural log x and we multiply by derivative by this natural log x mine times 1 over x natural log x derivative will be 1 over x this is a table cases okay what are we going to do next of course let's simplify this a little bit as a result we will have it will be equal to limit x approaches to infinity to natural log x over this x jump right here because we are dividing by this x, 3x cube. And let's use direct substitution. So I'll see that nothing changed because we'll have once more infinity over infinity. This goes to infinity and this goes to infinity as well. So it's really good to use L'Hopital's rule once more. So let's do this. Let's use this rule once more. So we will have limit x approaches to infinity of the function 2 natural log x derivative over 3x cube derivative as well. Let's find this derivative once more. So as a result we will have, this is a classic case, it will be limit x approaches to infinity 2 over x and in our denominator we will have 3 times 3 9x 9x square, 9x square, minus 1 right here. So let's use direct substitution, let's put this infinity right here. We will have an interesting case because we can simplify this a little bit before a direct substitution, x approaches to infinity. We can write this as 2 to the power 9x cubed, this x jump right here. We can do this. We will have 2 to the power 9x cubed. And this is the final, the final answer, the final result, because we can use a direct substitution right here, and we put, we can put this infinity in our 
denominator and we will have 2 over infinity which is equal to 0 if we are talking about limit doesn't matter 1 over infinity 100 over infinity or like 1000 over infinity doesn't matter if we have a constant in our denominator if you divide in this by infinity if you're talking about limit of course we have zero our answer will be equal to zero oh this is a little bit funny sign <laughs> this is this is our answer thank you so much for watching subscribing putting thumbs up i really appreciate it i really appreciate it that you like watch high mathematics if you like this video you put thumbs up i do months more and more videos integral matrix and it will be really interesting like for me and i hope for you as well so thank you so much for watching and see you in the next videos